All right, guys, we have the Mermedia Skull Dunker. This amazing bath bomb is actually made out of a skull cup. That's right, this skull cup right here, the eyes are cut out, as you can see the embeds. And on the top, we have a soap. This is Hungry for Brain Soap. It is colored in bright neon pink and green, and it is scented in Loving Spell. Loving it. So I'm going to pop the top off right here. This is where the straw would have went. Isn't this an amazing idea? Like, seriously. <laughs> you guys can catch the review that I made for this wonderful, amazing bath bomb and all the rest of her goodies on my channel. I will link the review in this video for you guys. Here is the soap that comes with this guy. You can find Mermedia on Facebook. You can like and follow her on Instagram, but her shop where she sells her products are on Facebook. All you have to do is look through her pictures, and as I've stated before, she has plenty of molds, scents, and colors that she can show you when she messages you, and if you have any ideas, you guys can bounce them off of each other. She makes amazing stuff, and this is num num num, hungry for brains. I love her labels. They're so beautiful. And look at the detail. Look at that. It's so impressive. So we're going to go over the soap as well. And we are going to go over this guy. I'm going to get him ready. I'm going to take the top of the foil off, put him in the bath, and see just what he does. Really quick, guys, I wanted to just show you the top. This is filled to the brim. Look at that. It's beautiful, beautiful, I love it. I love this whole creation, it's amazing. I cannot wait to see this bad boy go off in the water. All right guys, this is not the easiest to hold with my device in my hand. Isn't this awesome looking? Oh my God, that is so cool. I love how she cut the eyes out for the embeds. That is so beautiful. Let's see this guy go off. I'm sorry for the noise in the background. The toilet is just making a lot of noise. Oh, that is so cool. I also am going to get the top wet. Look at it go. Oh my God, that's amazing. I thought if I got the top wet, it wouldn't be so slow. Look at that. Oh, that is so awesome. Oh, it smells divine in here too. It smells so good. Look at this guy. <laughs> I, this is the coolest creation. Like, she is just so talented. I love the wicked stuff these ladies put together. Look at him. <laughs> that is really, really cool and neat. He's got some brain action. Sorry guys. Oh, do you see that pretty blue? Right over there, that's beautiful. Now she did tell me that there were plenty of embeds in there and there are some yellows. Oh, I cannot wait. And this thing is filled to the brim as you guys seen. I wanted to show you how this was looking when you take the top off and all of that good stuff and I wanted to show you how much was filled bath bomb wise before I stuck the cap on and put him back in 
And it's a good thing I remembered to put the cap on because I was actually about to put him in without the cap on and I was like, oh my god, what am I doing? <laughs> Oh, that is so decent. Stay over here. I notice when I push him down, look at all that good stuff. It smells so pretty. And look at that. This is beautiful. You don't really have to submerge them too much, but... I just love the sound. I love how all of him starts to foam out. That is so cool. So again, guys, the owner, creator, and maker of Mermedia is Natalie. She is something else, man. I'm telling you. Sorry, guys. But she is so creative, and her bath products are just, I can feel the moisture on my hands. I'm just so excited right now because I don't want to be loud, but look. Oh my God, it's so cool. <laughs> oh my God, that's awesome. She actually cut the eyes out to put the eye embeds in there. And again, this is a special bath bomb that she creates. And I think she, don't quote me, but I believe she only had like a limited amount. What's really cool is, again, this is a cup. The straw goes right here and she turned this cup into a bath bomb holder and basically a dunker. And it's something that's so different and so unique. You see a lot of cauldrons for the bath bomb Halloween time. And you know, you do see dunkers, but they're cauldrons or they're pumpkin dunkers. This is something that, you know, you're not gonna find anywhere else but on Mermedia. And she has very quick shipping, great customer service. Ordering from her is very easy. It's not difficult at all. You just, I mean, all of her products are shown on her Facebook page. And if you want, you can definitely go ahead and follow her and like her, which I would recommend on Instagram, because this way you can also see I mean, all of our products are listed on Facebook, but you can also get more pictures and updates on Instagram of her products, and then just list it, write it down, message her on Facebook, and start making your order. I know there is so much more. Look at all of it. Brains! <laughs> the top is just oozing. Oh, wow. Wow. This is incredible. I am so glad I got my hands in the sky. Look at them. And you guys see the yellow, the pinks, the purples. Let's get the shot up here. And that is so cool. Oh my God. Look at that beautiful, beautiful, just foaming action of all these different embeds. Look at all that pretty color.
Oh, I want to get a picture just like this. Look at that pretty pink and purple. I'm so in love. Mmm, it smells so good. Oh, so good. Oh, there's a little spot of purple. <laughs> Let's move him back a little bit here, guys. I'm going to dunk him again and let him go. Now, you obviously don't have to dunk him over and over and over. You can just definitely let him go and, you know, relax and enjoy this nice, foaming, huge dunker that's got a lot of bath bomb in it. But I want to give you guys, like, the full effect. Wow. Wow, that is so amazing. Look at all that beautiful color. Look at that. Yeah, if you guys have not ordered from Mermedia, I would highly recommend that you do so. She has a lot of unique blends. Um, beautiful, beautiful scented, amazing body lotions. Creamy, creamy, creamy body lotions and um, moisturizing creams. She also has amazing, I love her lip balms and her body sprays perfumes throughout this world and any scent that you like you can get in any product you literally can get it in your lip balm your bath balm your bubble bar your body cream your body spray your sugar scrub because she carries all of that good stuff <laughs> oh my god this is so cool And it's so pretty. It is so pretty. This has to be the coolest Halloween dunker. And I know we're in Christmas, but this is the coolest Halloween dunker I think I've ever laid eyes on. And look at that beautiful color down there. I'm going to give you guys a close-up. Look at those pretty, pretty pigmented pinks and orange, blues, and purple. This is just gorgeous. And it's... Look at that, he's overflowing at the head. I love that you get to keep the skull afterwards too. It is an awesome keepsake. Wow, that is beautiful. Smells incredible too. We're gonna go over the soap as well. Open that little bad boy up. And I can smell it through the packaging, which is amaze balls. Do you guys see that beautiful pigmented water? I mean, look at this. My tub is not even filled completely all the way up. And I could have filled it all the way up, it wouldn't have mattered because the pigment is beautiful. Wow. I'm sorry for the shakeage, guys. I really want to get a picture of this, but it's so hard because I can't hold it like that. Oh, that's driving me crazy. That is, that's got picture worthy all over it. And it is beautiful. I just love putting that, look at that, look at that when you put it in, look at how that goes. And then whoop. That is so awesome. Look at all that action. I love to see that this can go fast, it can go slow. You can let it float, you can dunk it under, you can submerge it. 
This thing is amazing. This is definitely like a 3D bath bomb. <laughs> the effect of it though is so cool. And this thing is still so heavy. <laughs> I wonder how much more bath bomb we have left. And you know what else? Because he's floating around, you know, he's wet, so he's going to keep coming out like that, which is great. But I'm wishing I kind of filled my water up just a little bit more. Because if I did, then the water would have... Oh my god, wait. It's got pretty glitters and shimmers. I didn't even notice that until now around the eyeballs. That's awesome. And I was wondering, you see that right there? Amazing. I love that right there. It's like a volcano going off in your tub. This is amazing. In 16 minutes and we're still going. A lot of foaming. This is moisturizing too. I'm rubbing my toesies together. Mm. Nice high moisture, beautiful shimmering water, great color pigment. A lot, a lot, a lot of bath bomb. And my bathroom smells incredible. Sorry guys, I just like playing with it. It's so awesome. That feels amazing too. It's nice, it's cold, it's frothy. And I drowned his butt. <laughs> Look at him go. That is beautiful, simply beautiful. I don't know what else to tell you guys. Again, I will have all of Remedia's information linked down below so you can find her on Instagram and definitely add and like her on Facebook so you can message her and order from her. I have many more demos to show you from um, her soaps and her sugar scrubs. I have two different formula, she has two different formulas of sugar scrubs. I have both of them so we are going to be going over them demo wise and check out the consistency of both and we have some soaps and we have her now this is what I wanted to update you guys on her too the, when I reviewed her haul I went over the amazing kids bath bomb that she has the pale buckets now my daughter Autumn, who just turned five, her favorite color is blue. So, of course, she got the blue one, which was scented in Laffy Taffy. Um, no, it was Laffy Guava Coconut. And we made that video. Man, we had some amazing pictures. I, I can't, I don't even want to spoil for you, so I'm not going to tell you what went on in that bath bomb. Because even though it was blue, Kylie's... You know, during Autumn's birthday vlog, I gave them that for the birthday present. It was supposed, you know, it was going to go to their Christmas, but I gave it to them for a birthday. Um, but Kylie, even though hers is pink, it will, it will have the same, same 
action that went on with the blue, I believe, because let's just, I can't tell you how amazing the embeds in the show were, blah, blah, the show was for the pale bath bomb for the kids. Wow. Oh my God. And we lost the video. Um, I used my love's device for that and unfortunately we woke up and the kids decided look at the rainbow I love it the kids decided oh my god look at that bright yellow oh my god it's so pretty are you guys wait I don't want it to get dark I don't want you guys to be able to see um they erase everything and even when we tried to back it up we couldn't so that video is lost it's the first video I've ever lost Luckily, we have another one, so no fears. The girls still got to enjoy that one, and we still have one to demo with you guys, so it's all good. Check out the colors. Oh, I'm so in love, and I can't stop dunking him, but that's what he is. He is a dunker. And that's the cool thing. So when people get, look how bright that yellow is, when people get a little upset and they're like, why don't you just let it go? Well, it's called a dunker for a reason. Oh, look at that purple. Mm. Mm. My nose is going to turn into a vacuum again. And like during the review when I sucked up some bath bomb products up my nose. <laughs> oh my God. See, something like this, it's huge, and it's a dunker. It's just, we have to play, guys. We have to play with it. And that's just fun in itself. Beautiful. 22 minutes, and we are still going. Oh, my God, it looks like, you know what? That just reminded me of a movie. There's a skeleton. Oh, my God. My feet were squeaking at the bottom. I wasn't tooting or anything. <laughs> um, it just reminded me of like the eyeballs on the oh Roger Rabbit at the end where like his face, his eyeballs start popping out. For some reason, the bubbles and the foam just reminded me of that. I don't know why, but I'm thinking of Roger Rabbit. If you guys like seriously, if you see what I'm saying, like right there when his eyes start popping out, <laughs> that's so cool. I definitely want to know your feedback, guys. What do you think? I don't know. Sorry, guys. I'm having some serious medical issues going on. Um, I want to know what you guys think about this dunker. Have you seen anything similar to it? Because I never have. I think this is seriously one of a kind. It's beautiful. I think it's amazing. Oh, it smells so good. So to let you guys know the medical problem that I'm having, um, I don't ever, pr I don't think I'm pronouncing it correctly, but it's a Bar Barcelona cis, and. I had it for four, I was diagnosed, well, I wasn't diagnosed, I'm sorry, I, well, I was diagnosed with something, and I am now a high risk for cervical cancer, unfortunately, I'm supposed to get checked every six months, and I do not do that, I have and I stopped, which is terrible and bad, and I should, but after I was notified as being a high risk for cervical cancer, I was basically having miscarriages and we were trying to get pregnant and luckily we did get pregnant with Autumn but um, I lost quite a few babies in the making of that of making her and um, she was a high risk I was a high risk during that pregnancy I was actually taking care of my mother because she had literally just fell 17 feet off the ladder and when she did that it was on Easter morning Kylie was only two and a half and um, yeah, she fell head and back first on the brick walkway in the backyard. Our neighbor jumped the privacy fence, was out of work for a week, but she split her head open. She broke every bone in her back and severed her spinal cord. She'll never walk again. 
when that happened, I was up in my, literally I was up in my room. I had no idea what was going on. And I had just had a procedure done, um, a biopsy. Well, after that, when my mother was in McGee, which is in Philadelphia, it's a rehabilitation center, like a rehab to help her, you know, learn how to adjust and move in her wheelchair. Because I was I was her legal guardian, um, her only child. She's not married. So it kind of all, you know, fell. Wow, look at that. It all fell on me. Um, however this is amazing and I love the color right now um with that being said I started having this little bump in a certain female area and it was too little for them to do anything about um after four to five years it grew so large it was when I they didn't believe me when I went to the hospital it was between like literally it was in between a golf ball and a tennis ball right in the middle of that and then when they checked me they're like, okay, so it's definitely in between that size. They took a needle that was approximately about this long. I kid you not. My love was there the whole time holding my hands. That needle, they had to stick all the way in my female area to numb it. And I literally said, like, my female parts just want to be loved. It didn't hurt nobody. And how would a man feel if I just ganked a needle up down there? You know what I mean? Like, just saying. <laughs> but um, then they took a knife and they cut it open. Um, they said once they did that, it wouldn't come back. I had a catheter put inside of me. And to make a long story short, because you guys don't need to know, or I'm sure you don't want to know these gory, disgusting details. Sorry if anything I've said has bothered anyone's sensitive ears if you do have them i'm sorry um but then last year it kept coming back and i had to keep going through this and um i hated it i refused to go i didn't want to go well i had to go back the last time because it began to grow so large that i couldn't sit i couldn't lay i couldn't stand and it was making its way all the way in the back hmm <sighs> well they were supposed to surgically remove it. However, because of the spot that it's in, they refuse to. But it keeps coming back, and now it's worse than it ever has been. And um, it's a lot of pain. It's, it's very, very, very painful. Um, it has to be tested for uh, cancer. The gynecologist that I did see said that she doesn't think it's cancerous, which is great, and I am hoping that she's correct and not an imbecile um but i just have to get this taken care of and everyone here is a little po'd with me because they want me to go to the hospital and i refuse to go because it's painful all right we are like 30 minutes in let's just dunk this guy i love that this is a long lasting bath bomb i am going to tell you right now that her products are reasonably priced okay for how beautifully pigmented, how amazingly scented they are, and the scents will linger on your skin. They're high moisturizing. It's amazing. And to have this huge, incredibly creative dunker that literally, you know, she made it out of a cup. That's thinking outside of the box. And that's somebody that I really love ordering from because she has literally... How many times am I going to say literally, right? She has seriously, let me change the word up. <laughs> she has taken an idea and ran with it. Very, very creative. It's different. It's unique. And the price, considering how much bath bomb is in here, how much in beds are in here, the shimmer, the luster, the fact that the scents and the blends are amazing. She puts a soap a soap guys and she let me pick the color of my soap i love that because she had three different colors i think there was um a blue and green um i think there was even a purple and green and that's my joker color and i usually go with that but i loved the pink and the green oh that look at those embeds i mean this is amazing and the fact that you can dunk it and make it just go as fast as you want 
or wow. Oh my God. Or you can make it go nice and slow and just relax. This is incredible. Look at that. Okay, no, this is, I need some pictures of this. You will turn. <laughs> you will work with me. All right, guys, I have to. <laughs> the picture looked better in the water. Yes, it did. I don't know what I was doing. I love that there is blue. Look at all this. It's just, it's amazing. And we're already 30 minutes in this sucker. Look at all this pretty color. Oh my God. I am so lucky to have found Mermedia as a company to order from. I'm literally just in love with her products and to have found the owner which is Natalie also as a friend um you know just so you guys know I do not mix and I do not expect anyone that I order from to mix friendship with business that is not what we that's not what I like doing I have been in sales before I am in sales I do sell candles, wax, wax warmers, scented plushies and teddy bears and, you know, it's a more affordable um, Build-A-Bear. So, you know, I know how it is and um, being in sales can be hard, but, you know, and Natalie is an incredible woman and a friend and as business, she is business savvy. She knows what she's doing. Look, man, like, come on. It just, it doesn't stop. It just keeps getting better and better and better. I feel like I've hit the jackpot lately. Seriously. I have literally found and been lucky enough to have come across some of the most amazing, talented companies and women there possibly is. And this is just phenomenal. Look at all of that goodness back there. The water pigment. Woohoo, we have that bright neon yellow, which I love. This is so pretty. I'm gonna give you guys a close up. You can see all that shimmer. Look at that. That's beautiful, isn't it? Diamonds are forever. <laughs> I'm so dumb. <laughs> Just got done actually watching the last Freddy movie they made. For real. Okay, I only watched it because it's a Freddy movie, but um, I tried watching it on Showbox before we actually, you know had it come out oh my god yeah i love freddie but how dare you how dare you insult robert like that like for real and um i swear to god my love he when i first met him i told him i just can't put my finger on it you look like somebody you really do and then it hit me i said oh my god you look like robert Edling, like the guy who plays freddie cougar but without all you know, the junk on his face outside of his mask. And my mother was in the car and she's like, have you ever heard that before? And he was like, yeah, actually I have quite a few times. And uh, my, you know, our daughter is Kylie, our oldest. She's like, no, he doesn't. Daddy doesn't look like that. But they're sexy, so I don't mind. I think Robert Ling's I think he's a good looking man, I do. And it's weird because I can honestly say that's usually not my taste when it comes to men, but I find him attractive. And look at that. Oh my God, it's so sparkly. Okay guys, just look at all that pretty sparkle and look at the pigment of that water. And he is still going.
I don't think we have time to review the soap. This guy is still going. I don't know, are we done? Let's pop the top off and let's check it out. All right, guys, I'm going to pop the top off. I'm going to check it out. I still see foam, but let's check to see. Oh, yeah, if there's any more. I guess there is. But I think we are coming to the end of our dunker. This is amazing. This dude is still chugging along. And look at the eyes, it's like puffing. <laughs> yeah I still hear some so we have a little bit I'm gonna fill it up and I'm just gonna let it go and why that goes give me one second guys as I open up our num 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 hungry for brains lemon spell soap and We'll see how that lathers. I'll tell you how it smells. Give me one second, guys. All right, guys. This is the Num 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 Hungry for Brains Loving Spell Soap. There we go. Look at that. Ain't that pretty? That's really pretty. And I want to give you a peek of this water and the shimmer before we get into the soap. So as my... Dunker still goes off. I just want you guys to check out how beautiful this pigment water is. I want you guys to see the shimmers and that luster. Oh, it's beautiful. And there, look, it's like all over his head. <laughs> it's beautiful purple glitters and lusters and shimmers. And it's really, really, really pretty. And there is nothing sticking to the wall, of course, because she does not stain your bathtub whatsoever. This water is beautiful. There you go. You guys see that? Ain't that beautiful? It's really pretty. So here is our soap. Oh, <laughs> that got close up. Now you guys will see there is some green. But you guys don't have to worry about that because literally just like the Fizz the Love Soap that was yellow, it'll come right off of your hands and this smells so good and it looks so pretty that I don't want to ruin it. I, I don't want to do it, but your soap will stay pink. It's just the green that is going to come off. So let's dunk it. Oh my God, it smells so good. And look how pretty it is. That is so awesome looking. There is some red up top even. Mmm. Ooh, that... Her love spell is like dead on. It is not an imitation at all. That is the cutest damn soap. Alright. I'm gonna get some lather. Now, the only thing I can lather for you guys to see is my leg. And we have a nice, nice, nice lather. This is a very creamy soap. It really is. I love the feel. Oh, look. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Oh, I am just so in love with this. And you guys are seeing the bubbles, the lather. Mm, that smells amazing. And you see there's pink glitters? No way. Again, this is Mermedia, people. 
You can find Mermedia, Natalie, the owner and maker, on Facebook. This woman, she has made wax, candles. She's She had brought up an idea for a cleaning product to clean out your tub after or before you use your bath bombs. She makes soap, body sprays. She has two formulated sugar scrubs, lotions, tons of bath bombs. You can literally look at molds. She's got tons, tons of molds and her pigment and colors, her shimmers. And literally, if you don't like shimmers or glitters or, you know, stuff like that, or if you don't like a scent, all you do is just tell her. She'll make it the way you like it and how you want it to be made. So she does make custom orders. Look at that. Mm. Nice. Oh, that smells beautiful. Oh my God, yes. Okay, I don't want to use it anymore because I want to save it. I do. I don't think I have another love. Do I? I don't know. All her soaps smell so darn good. But I will rinse this beautiful little doozer off so I can put it in my little soap dish. Oh, it feels so amazing. It really is silky and so smooth. And I love the color. I really do. That is one of my, like, oh, I love that color. I don't even want to put it down. That is so creamy. Look at that. Look at that nice lather. And that's a two-in-one fur. Seriously, you're getting that with your bath bomb. And not only do you get the soap, you get this keepsake. Whoa, he is covered in some serious glitter, people. Oh my god. And he still has stuff coming out of him. Are you kidding me? So all of this, as you can see, ready? Just so you guys can see, wipes right off. Right off. There's no sticking. There's no nothing. It just wipes right off. And now let's look at this water. Mm, I love it. This is a beautiful maroon colored water. This reminds me of a wine, like a wine colored water. It's beautiful. And let's undunk him and let's just go over this. So you get this massive dunker cup side this cup filled with bath bomb plus a, a num num hungry for brain soap you get this beautiful embedded bath bomb colored water with a shimmer and sparkles if you want or not one it's all up to you but this is amazing again another thumbs up to natalie she does such amazing stuff and i'm gonna go fill the rest of my water up and I'm gonna lay back and I'm gonna relax because I'm just in love. It smells so good in here. Oh, and the moisture. Oh, look at this. You guys, we always gotta do the finger test, right? Some nice moisture, just so silky, so, so silky. All right, guys. Well, that is it on the Mermedia's Skull Dunker Bath Bomb and the Num Num Hungry for Brains Loving Spell Soap that comes with it. And you guys got to see this amazing keepsake that, again, is really cool. And you can see that she cut out the eyes. You can see that there goes the straw. Like, this was a cup. It's so awesome. And you just pop the top. And you can put what you want in it after you wipe it down. And that's amazing. And then you have your soap that you can wash yourself off with. And this beautiful, beautiful shimmering water. Look at that. It's just so beautiful. Again, guys, I will have her Instagram page listed down below. Follow her, like her so you can see her products. She makes amazing, amazing, amazing out of the box type of work. And I've already listed all the amazing products. She even makes men's 
um, cologne spray. She makes men's scented items and so much. There's just so much. And again, you can order from her on Facebook. She is working on getting an Etsy shop, but for right now, she's on Facebook. There is nothing wrong with that. She is doing her thing. So like her and follow her on Facebook. And if you have any questions about her products, she has no problems, you know, helping you out. But all you have to do is just go through her pictures and check them out. So, yes, definitely go follow and like Natalie, the owner and creator of Remember Media. I want to thank her. This was amazing. I'm so glad I got it. Let me know your comments, your thoughts, your opinions down below. And, I mean, is this not one of a kind of a bath bomb? And what do you think about this water? It's beautiful. And that brain soap, it's beautifully pigmented. I love that pink and it smells incredible. She has literally the only love smell that I've the only love spell that I've ever sent smelled rather that's not synthetic -y. like it's not fake it it just smells it smells like it's Victoria's Secret so if you like love spell you're gonna love her love spell scent it seriously the best dupe I've ever smelled for love spell Victoria's Secret and this is gorgeous so I'm gonna shut up now I'm gonna relax I've kept you guys long enough. We, this was a long bath bomb and I've enjoyed every second of it. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this and as it went off, I hope you guys enjoyed hanging out with me. I love you guys and if, which I will, the next one we will be doing is our lush Christmas bubble bar. But um, yeah, so I will be seeing you guys before the holiday. I love you guys. Thanks for hanging out with me. Mwah. I hope you're enjoying your weekend and I love you guys.